Look, uh, let's, I would like to start by acknowledging, which I'm sure all of you do as well, sending my prayers for the health and safety of the First Lady and President, uh, the President of the United States after they tested positive for COVID-19. My wife Jill and I pray that they'll make a quick and full recovery. This is not a matter of politics. It's a bracing reminder to all of us that we have to take this virus seriously. It's not going away automatically. We have to do our part to be responsible. It means following the science, listening to the experts, washing our hands, social distancing. It means wearing a mask in public and means encouraging others to do so as well. We can save 100,000 lives in the next 100 days, according to the head of the CDC, if everyone wears a mask in public. So be patriotic. It's not about being a tough guy. It's about doing your part. Wearing a mask is not only going to protect you, but it also protects those around you. Your mom, your dad, your brother, your sister, husband, wife, neighbor, co-worker. Don't just do it for yourself. Do it for the people you love, the people you work with. But this cannot be a partisan moment. It must be an American moment. We have to come together as a nation. I'm running as a Democrat, but I am will run and govern as an American president. Whether you voted for me or against me, I will represent you. And those who see each other as fellow Americans who just don't live in red states or blue states, but who live in and love the United States of America, that's who we are. And there's never been a single solitary thing America's been unable to do. Think of this, not once. Not a single thing we've not been able to overcome when we've done it together. So let's get the heck up. Remember who in God's name we are. This is the United States of America. There's nothing beyond our capacity. I want to say God bless you. May God protect the first family and every family that's dealing with this virus. And may God protect our troops. Thank you, thank you, thank you.